There's a really good Andrew Tate revelation. I mean, it's fun to see because he's part of the ultra conservative reactionary alpha males. And there's a video that surfaced from 2021 july of him doing this kind of bit that i see a lot of conservatives do i've seen i saw joe rogan do it recently where he the the shtick is like oh well trans women they have a dick so it's less gay and they're just worried about they're like if i'm watching porn i need it to be the least gay possible porn but so in their mathematics they think that Oh, do trans <laughs> i think you said that wrong. No, trans porn is less gay in their opinion because the the person with the penis also has boobs. Oh, I see what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. So they've crunched the numbers on that. Right. So instead yeah. of like, they're doing, if the, you, they're doing the calculus. If you look at a woman, a s traditional cis woman, she's got boobs and a vagina. So she's 100% not gay. Okay. This yep. is now, Again, if you look to at, be clear, this is Joe Rogan. You're, 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 <laughs> I'm analyzing, you're analyzing right, right, right. the logic of, of Rogan. Okay. Yeah, and so if you look at a trans woman, she has boobs, so that's not gay. Right. And she, but she, but she has a penis, which is gay. Right. So instead of fifty percent gay, watching trans porn is only is actually seventy five percent straight. Straight. And twenty five percent gay. Yeah. Okay. So that's what Joe Rogan and so, I. So 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 in their view, just traditional heterosexual porn with them with a cis man and woman having sex that's fifty percent gay. It's gay. That's yes, fifty percent gay. It's fifty, <laughs> and they and they they're ashamed to watch that. Okay. It's fifty fifty. Right. <laughs> well, there you go. He just said it <laughs> it's, 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 so here is Andrew Tate. Oh, you should of, give a trigger warning too. By the way. What is he? Oh, he says the T. Uh, he's, there's some slurs in this. It, he, it's, it's such a bizarre clip because he's like kind of, he's kind of supporting oh, he's trans, trans rights, rights, but like in the in the most misogynistic, insane God. way possible, while also dropping slurs left and right. Yes, but it is interesting. Um, it gives chaser energy, and uh, well, that's what everybody's saying. It's it's so it is very interesting. It's like. There is a phenomenon of these ultra masculine alpha sigma whatever they see themselves And these are the guys who spend all day in the gym. They are admiring each other's physique They're getting jacked for each other. We've established that women aren't really attracted to like big old muscle dudes That's Bugatti. like a guy thing Bugatti. And so I do think like deep down a lot of these guys do want to fuck dudes. They're bisexual. They're bi curious it's, yeah, it's a spectrum. Which is natural, right? Mm -hmm. It's just less acceptable for men to express that yeah, they're curiosity. To, which he yeah. does say in this video as well. He does say that. He's, so surprisingly vulnerable. Gender is, gender is a spectrum and, a, and fluid. He says it all. So it's like he's saying some good stuff and intermingling it with slurs and... Um, well, you'll see. I mean... There's one Got part in particular that really gets me about it. So we're gonna insane. we're gonna analyze this, and it's very interesting. It is very interesting. But if you're if you're sensitive to a, tra a slur for trans people, you guys know the word I'm referring to. He does say it. So heads up on that one. Here it is, Andrew Tate. Ignore the, ignore the construction. I'm rebuilding my mansion. You'll see when it's shut up. <laughs> Don't hear any construction. <laughs> <laughs> Your mansion sucks, by the way. If you have to rebuild it, shit sucks. He Broke. said nothing, and it was too much. <laughs> yeah, stop. Got two words in. Stop. It's pausing. <laughs> it's done. We'll do an episode of Cribs. I had to get this area here. I bought my neighbor's house. I had to construct a specific area for the Bugatti. Turn it up a little bit. Anyway, the Bugatti, dude. Why button it at all at that point? I mean, the man button it like a suit, <laughs> like a suit jacket. Right. <laughs> It's that's not a suit jacket, dude. It's right. a fucking shirt. I mean, you're Zach. You're way more buttoned up than him. He's got one button, like on the belly button. <laughs> right. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway, that's all gonna be lit up and shit. Bugatti logos. You broke boys don't know. Listen, Bugatti. I recently posted a question on Twitter, asking. Would you rather have sex with a transsexual, which is a legitimate 10, or a woman, which is a legitimate 1? Okay, so 
So he is admitting, uh, in a sense, that so he's, he, he's already player. admitting too much that it, for his comfort. He doesn't realize. He's saying, I, there's transsexual women who are a 10. Right. Yeah. Yeah, which I think already for a lot of his fans would be too far. Like, they, in mm-hmm. their world, it, that, that's, he's that doesn't exist. He's, that's not a thing. Yeah, to call someone a right. 10, you're establishing you're attracted to that. 10 right. is like... Absolutely. 10 is like... The example he uses is Megan Fox. Okay, so there you go. Is a well, there a lot of guys say she's a 10. And she's, you know, Helen of Troy. <laughs> launched a thousand ships. I would launch his a ship. house. His house looks like a fucking Roblox house. Look in the yeah, back. Yeah, it does. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck is that? I mean, it makes it looks sense. Like he, cardboard. He, he's like a man baby, so it makes sense. <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah. And everyone's sitting there clicking woman, 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 because they think they're going to be gay if they do anything else. But they're not actually thinking about the question. I'm. And, and what's interesting is, like, he won't let it go. He put the question on Twitter, and all of his... Uh, Hyper masculine, probably somewhat homophobic fans are like woman. And what we also let's keep but, in mind that this video is 2021, summer of 2021, where he was known on the internet, but far from like 2022 was the year that he became a phenomenon and got okay. gained a lot of his new fans. So you have to imagine it's a much more like niche audience that he's speaking. Okay, for. okay, yeah, sure, I, I, I that's true. But he he won't let it go because I think he has this desire and he he needs he needs people to understand that he's not gay for feeling this way. Right. He's he 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 needs the world to understand that. He goes, they think it's gay, but let me tell you why wrong. They're not why they're wrong <laughs> right. and why it's okay to have sex with trans women. Right. And of course it is. Right. But I'm just trying to no, that's psychoanalyze the, I, like, them. Like, like, there's so many layers to this, but yeah, I guess. It really is. It, it's, <laughs> it really is more layered than Shrek, who's the ultimate onion to unlayer. I'm gay. <laughs> I just watched that for the first time in a while with Theodore. Did he like it? The OG Shrek? Um, I don't know if he made it all the way through. It's, it's hard to get him through a whole movie. Okay. It's I a good like movie, Shrek, though. I liked it a lot. you're in my swamp. I love that. that I first... You've always liked Shrek. You've always had an affinity for Shrek. I love me some Shrek. Yeah. Back to uh, this ogre. Think they're going to be gay if they do anything else, but they're not actually thinking about the question. I am. So- you didn't know. It's not gay. You need to think about it more. <laughs> it's a riddle. <laughs> Trust me. Yeah, it's a riddle. We need to untangle this. It's not gay. I promise you. So smart. I operate on so many levels. <laughs> I'm so smart. I figured out how I can have sex with a trans girl and it not be gay. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Higher than the average man. You people are not thinking about the question. When I say a one and a ten, I mean Megan Fox with a dick, that's the tranny, or Hulk Hogan with a pussy. <laughs> uh, it's Got okay, you. bro. You can you can have sex with a trans person. It doesn't make you. I mean, the whole. Uh, it just doesn't. Yeah. Let's not don't. It, the classification doesn't matter, bro. Just be your true, authentic self, my dude. Which he goes on to say in a second. Shut okay, up. Okay, okay, okay. That's the girl. This is the question I'm asking. Megan Fox or Hulk Hogan? So you're thinking, well, I don't want to be gay, so uh, I just uh, clicked the girl the number one, did it? You're going to fuck Hulk Hogan? Okay, there's a pussy, <laughs> but he's got mustache and muscles and shit. He's all hairy. Big. Okay, so like, he's really and so invested in this analogy. It's like out of nowhere. I mean, this man... He's trying to justify, he really is trying to convince himself that deep down he's not gay. This is what's happening. Big dude, six foot five. That's pretty gay to me. That sounds pretty gay. I don't care if it's a pussy guy, he's gay. (laughs) There's Megan Fox, okay, he's got a dick, but maybe you can like, scoot it out the way. I'm still Megan Fox. You know what I'm saying? At least she's small and shit and get your hand around her neck. So what are you doing with- Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, He just said the part that really brings us to a whole nother level. Okay, let me go back. Scoot it. Out the way, I'm still Megan Fox. You know what I'm saying? At least she's small and shit and get your hand around her neck. Mess her up. Okay. So. What? (laughs) Yeah, it's preferable to sleep with trans women because I can beat them up. If they're 10. Right. Because if they were. No, but just like, that's like, like, he kind of, like, that's the, like, the rationale in his mind is like, I can't beat up Hulk Hogan. The, 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 The predominant qualifier is that. 
he can overpower them right. and beat them up. The way that he does with women, which Hulk we know Hogan is also the case. With a pussy. <laughs> you ain't messing up Hulk, Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan's gonna mess you up. So this is the question I'm asking. You need to operate on a higher plane. Think about this. Bro, how does he wear this shirt? It's so tight. Like, his circulation has got to be getting cut off. Like, that thing is just tight as could be. I'm so smart. Nah, okay. Think about this. This is important. This is cultural. This affects the world we now live in. What is straight? What is gay? It's all a big sliding spectrum, isn't it? Yes. Because if you're going to sit here and go, oh, no, no, it's gay to bang Megan Fox with a dick. I counter that argument. It's gay to bang Hulk Hogan with a pussy. <laughs> so which one is it? <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> Just the it's like. Delivery on that is so wild. <laughs> I mean, this uh, is really progressive, frankly, what he's prof he's putting forward at the end there is like, guys. Right, that's the thing, is it's like, there's, it's this bizarre interweaving of like, a very like, kind of open, progressive mindset about sexuality, and also like, it's being motivated by deep misogyny of like, I, I need to be able to beat the shit out of whoever I'm sleeping with. <laughs> well, I don't want to be gay. It reminds me of like, a religious person who's secretly gay, like, I'm getting those vibes, like he, he's gonna try to pray away the gayness or something. And, well, it's a loophole. Not, it's a gay loophole. Right, yeah. It's like how you're still virgin if you only do <laughs> anal. Right. Like, it's a loophole. It's a god loophole. Uh, yeah. Pretty interesting though, but I like the wokeness at the end. He's like, listen, it's all on the spectrum. Let's just be, let's just love is love. Right, which he may he have- He said love is love. He may have sincerely thought at the time. Um, I don't think he would say any of these things today. Like, I don't think, like, again, this was 2021 before he really, like, struck figurative gold, I guess literal gold, with uh, the audience that he found. Mm -hmm. um, then he had to get back in the closet, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't think, uh, I don't think he would say the same today. Hey, hey Zach, uh, Naley- Naily, Naily asks, says she's 21 years old, Zach. Oh. I'm 21. Fuck you. That's what she asked for. <laughs> Logan says, hey, podcast with peace and love. Can you please wish my girlfriend happy birthday? We bonded over the podcast. We've been together for almost three years and had a beautiful baby. I love that. Congratulations, you guys. Love is love. Yes, sir. Thank you for the five gifted, JoJo. Here actually is... So this may surprise you, but he actually built this in Roblox before he built it in real life. <laughs> That's smart. You know, just to feel it out. And he liked the way it looked in the game, so he, uh, he built it. Yeah, <laughs> there it is. Mm -hmm. So I guess congratulations um, to Andrew Tate for... Uh, Dang saying, friends, love right? is love. It's gay to bang Hulk Hogan with a pussy. <laughs> okay, I mean, it's an interesting theory. <laughs> I'm so smart. It's the, it's the Nick Fuentes, I've heard this so many times, Nick Fuentes, if you think about it, having sex with women is pretty gay. I'm a virgin. With a dick. Which means I'm straight. <laughs> I don't know, these guys, they're wrapped up in pretzels. Somebody, uh, El Elwood in the chat said, uh, he would 100% say those things today and he just try and rebrand it as ultra alpha. Yeah, I mean, I, like you just said with the Nick, uh, maybe, maybe he'd find a way to, I don't know. I don't know. It just, again, because this was before, like, he really got on that, the Matrix is silencing me, red pill shit. Uh, I don't know how it would really fly with his current audience. And before he found Allah. As well, oh, right. Allah's he's a man down, of God. Bro. He's, he's big time Allah's God. not down with that shit. I mean, I, right, AB? I mean, in general. I mean, uh, most conservative all religions. Religions, like yeah. Religions, so, yeah. May Allah awaken the people. That's true, I guess. When you go conservative enough, everybody's not down with right. it. Uh, so there it is. And he's not. He is not a reformed. He went hardcore Islam. I think he's like. Well, I mean. <laughs> Did we, was there ever any evidence of him being faithful other than him just saying, I'm a Muslim now? There's clips of him in a mosque and stuff. Okay. Right. I, I don't know if that proves anything, but he seems pretty sincere about it. Well, apparently, uh, he was trying to flee to, uh, 
to Dubai to escape the uh, the charges in Romania, and so maybe does not maybe he was trying to ingratiate himself uh, in the Middle East mm. so that he wouldn't get extradited or something. I don't know. I don't know. Here's the words of an Andrew Tate stand. He goes, "Never seen Star Wars. None of them. Never will." Oh my God, you're missing out. Maybe you're missing out on being a multi-millionaire. Keep your movie. <laughs> I don't think you understand what it means to be a millionaire. But uh, 